Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Before we do begin today's video, make sure you guys are going down below and smashing that subscribe button. But we have been playing the early access to the Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War beta this week. Thursday and Friday, obviously today is Saturday, so I presume the open beta. You guys will have access to it by the time you see this video, and that's why I wanted to make this video as well. As you can see, it's a different type of video as I usually would do. We're talking about the FOV slider inside of the beta. This is something we've never ever seen on console and has been in pretty much every single PC game for as long as I can remember. This was a huge thing that people moaned about at the start of Modern Warfare. You know, PC players in this game had this feature and it brung them, gave them literally a huge, huge, huge advantage, which was definitely, which just wasn't fair at all. As you can see on the left, this is the standard, you know, screen. This is what you get standard on any other Call of Duty game, the field of view. That's what FOV stands for, so that's what I can see around me. And on the right hand side is the max FOV. So you guys can notice a huge, huge difference here. As you can see to my side, my movement looks a lot more slicker. It looks quicker. My gun looks, you know, a little bit more all over the place whilst I'm looking around. It's, it's You can definitely tell, and I can see huge, huge things around me, like more things around me, like I'll be able to notice enemies quicker from the side, whereas if they don't have this turned on, they're a huge, huge disadvantage, and this is why I'd recommend when you guys do get your hands on the beta, to go ahead and change your settings straight away, you don't have to max it out like I have, just find something that works for you, but I would definitely, up, uh, you know, I recommend increasing this from the standard FOV, as you're just going to be at a disadvantage to all the players like me, who are playing with the increased FOV and can see, you know, a bigger field of view and give them, it gives you a huge advantage, let's be honest. The reason you guys clicked on this video was to see how you do it. Basically, you hop into the settings, press options before you hop into a lobby. Hop over to settings, go to the graphics tab, and there you can see the field of view slider. Just change it to whatever you want to be. Have it as, as a little diagram to give you, you know, a kind of gist of what it's going to look like. Also have weapon blur, motion blur, sorry, disabled as it's going to help you see things around you very, very easy. But back into the comparison anyway, I don't have the weapon blur, the motion blur turned off in this, these two gameplays. Unfortunately, I didn't actually realise it was a feature in this game. Even though I had changed the FOV, I didn't actually even notice that setting. So, make sure you do change that one as well. It was a huge thing in Modern Warfare to have that turned off as well. It's going to be exactly the same in this game. Because if you imagine you're running around the map really, really quickly, you're looking side to side, you're going to get a blur on your screen and it's going to actually disorientate your vision. You're not going to be able to see people. There has been times where I've been, you know, skipping around the map, looking left to right, and someone kills me and I'm like, how the hell has this kid killed me how has he seen me that simple fact i just didn't see him because the side of my screens are blurry so big cap there on my part make sure you guys do have that disabled make sure you have the fov maximum or whatever you want to have it as just make sure you increase it from the standard because you just put yourself at a huge disadvantage i know this guys this was a short video guys hope you guys didn't mind i just wanted to put this out there for anybody who doesn't actually know how to change it it's pretty much pretty self-explanatory and i'm sure you know most of you know already know how to do it but if you don't that's how you do it huge huge advantage but apart from that guys hope you guys did find this helpful thank you guys so much for watching if you do want to see more daily call of duty content we're grinding the beta this weekend there's going to be so much content it's also next weekend as well there's so much beta content to come make sure you guys are smashing that subscribe button make sure you're dropping a like as well but apart from that guys thank you guys ever so much for watching i hope to catch you guys in the next one peace